and it was confirmed by Palestinians, Lebanese, and of course the Israeli soldiers, that the PLO were not just returning the Israeli fire back at the Israelis. They were actually shelling their own people, weren't they, to make it look worse for the Israelis? That's correct. They actually shelled the, the civilian areas of East Beirut. Uh, I, you know, when I was in this country reading and looking on television every night, it was my impression that the PLO were under siege. Israelis had control of everything. They had their guns up there on the mountains. They were firing in on the PLO. And I thought that the rest of Lebanon would probably be very safe. Uh, when I got there, I realized that the PLO was still extremely strong, even though the Israelis were bombing their positions constantly. They had enough ammunition and enough guns to send back tremendous firepower, but they didn't aim it at the Israeli soldiers. They aimed it at the civilian areas, uh, the civilian areas because they wanted to kill civilians because they knew if they could kill civilians, that would put more international pressure on the Israelis to stop. <sighs> that gets the old German well, it, blood uh, stirring. What, what would uh, make you upset was that, you know, the press kind of ignored it. But, you know, when I look back at all of this, God has a reason yes, for it. Lebanon is a wicked country. Uh, you talk about...